Hello. This is my Ogival automatic vintage watch from the, I'd say the 1970s. I don't know exactly. I don't know a huge amount about it other than it's fantastic. Um, 25 joules, waterproof, ink block. That's what it says on the dial. Ogival automatic. Ogival is a well-respected old Swiss watch manufacturer and they were set up according to the internet sort of 1903 something like that and they made a whole bunch of watches and then they just sort of faded away I think but this is a fantastic little watch um, and as I said I don't know a huge amount about it or them but I'm going to show you it and you can uh, just appreciate the watch with me and we'll have a look at it together. So let's start with the dial. Uh, the most noticeable thing, obviously, is that fish over on the nine o'clock. And it's a, a, a lovely applied golden fish. And it's called the Lucky Leaping Fish. That's their little symbol of um, the Ogival use. Over on the other side, we've got this fantastic gold framed date window with red and red date and red day and then a green number and that number is for the day of the week so we've got a lot of colors going on it's really really cool and funky then the uh the hands plain white uh let's, let's see if we can zoom in a little bit on that nice plain white needle hands second hand sweeping nicely away uh, and the center um of the of all the hands is sort of golden and then the indices all the way around, nicer sort of batten indices. Again, they're applied, can you see? Uh, quite thick, uh, with little white dashes down the centre. Uh, no loom. And that this minute track going all the way around the outside, second hand reaching it. And then as you see, as it comes around the corner, there it can't quite reach the, uh, the corners of that rounded square. Let's just watch it as it goes past the fish. That's cool, isn't it? So the Ogival logo uh, is that font there. Again, it's a, it's a nice applied golden font logo. And that's it for the dial. Uh, lovely squared sort of TV case. Um, the crystal is a bit proud of this stepped case that's... Uh, uh, it's, I, I don't quite know how to describe it, but I don't really need to because you can see it. Uh, it's got lots of different angles going on. The crown, let's zoom in and try and focus, is signed. Now it's a little bit small. Let's see if uh, my magnifying glass helps. You see? The um, bracelet sort of disappears into the lugs there underneath the case 18 millimeter lug width and on the back we've got a lovely case back uh, let's see so you can see the leaping fish in the water and then around the outside I'm going to struggle bear with me uh, I want to show you show you it there you go you can see these little fish all the way around the outside of the thing and it says I'm going to read to you because you probably won't be able to see it, it says Ogival all stainless steel, um, waterproof, automatic. So that's uh, that's it. And then this bracelet is uh, is the original bracelet. I don't know what that would be called this style, but it's uh, you know it's a very basic. It's nothing particularly fancy as uh, as those these bracelets of that time are. But it is signed. It's the original Ogival bracelet. So let's uh, give it a little measure, shall we? As I said, the, the lug width is 18 mil. The width of the dial itself without the, without the uh, crown, 36 millimeters. I'll pop it on my wrist. So seven and a half inch wrist. The bracelet is ever so slightly too small for me, but there we go. So that's, that's it on my wrist. Super cool. Nice, nice vintage look, it's really cool. Now, oops, sorry about that. One last thing that I want to show you is the movement, which is absolutely beautiful, um, I think. Um, and as I said, as I lean into the 
microphone. I don't really know um, much about this watch. Oh, I should say, uh, the internet says it's Ogival Fisk, um, the brand. So I don't know what the Fisk element is. Um, I misread it originally and thought it was Ogival Fish because of the Fish logo, but uh, no, it isn't, it's Fisk. So if you know if you know anything about it, I'd love to uh, hear about it on the in the comments below. So there, right? We've I've popped open the case. It's got a <clears throat> it's got a gasket. It does say it's waterproof. It doesn't say to how much, how many meters. Um, it's not a diver's watch. And there's the movement. Lovely little movement. Signed Ogival. Slightly decorated. Sort of coppered movement. Twenty five jewels in there. So there we go. So that is it for my lovely little Ogival vintage watch. Cool, huh? <laughs> Please subscribe for more watch videos. I also do knife and EDC videos. Like if you liked it and leave a comment below. Uh, we can have a little chat about this watch. Thanks for watching. I'll see you soon.